What up people, Fakuno is nice to hear with how to men. I received plenty of comments, tweets, and DMs to do a what's on my Android phone, so I decided it was about that time again since the last time I did a video like this was over a year ago. So let's start it off with the device I'm currently using. As you can tell from the video's title, I'm still rocking the OnePlus 6. Why? It's still one of the fastest, if not the fastest smartphone on the market. I also love its giant display, the notch isn't tremendously large, and its stock like Android software with consistent software updates knocks it out of the park. Click the i in the right corner if you want to check out my full review of the OnePlus 6. As for the software, I'm currently on OnePlus's open beta program to obtain Android Pie. I'm still encountering a few bugs throughout this update such as sometimes I can't switch to my previously used app when using Android Pie's default gesture navigation. Other than that, this update is way more stable than their developer preview version. I reviewed Android Pie on the OnePlus 6 not too long ago on Android Police's YouTube channel, so click the i in the right corner to check it out. Also if you're wondering, I'm not rooted. I feel like OnePlus already provides the features and customizations I desire. Taking a look at what's actually on my home screen, I'm rocking Rootless Pixel Launcher by Amir's 80. I'm a huge fan of Google Stock Launcher known as Pixel Launcher, and I found Amir's version to be the best replication with a few added features. On top of having all the Pixel Launcher stock features, Amir's release supports icon packs, has a dark theme, and lets you disable the at a glance widgets. In my opinion, Google nailed the layout and design of their stock launcher app, so I don't see a reason to optimize anything. But if you want something similar with a few more options for customization, then I recommend using Launcher V2 or Nova Launcher. I'll drop both links right below that like button. For my widgets, I'm using an app called Pixie KWGT. It's a dollar in the Play Store, but it's definitely worth the buck since you get some beautiful widgets with over 100 to choose from, and all of them have a material design and Google theme, so they fit perfectly with my launcher. Since I don't like to clutter my home screens with too many widgets, I'm also using two Pixie widgets. Number 131, which is on my home screen. It allows me to see the date, the Spotify track or YouTube video that I'm currently playing, and the weather in my area. I modified it a bit to make tapping on each square bring up its related application. And on my second screen to the right, I have Pixie widget number 43, which is a calendar widget to see my upcoming events. Now you can't use Pixie KWGT without a separate app called KWGT Custom Widget Maker and the Pro Key version. The Pro Key version does cost $4.49, but I recommend the purchase because if you don't already know, practically every beautiful widget you see in a home screen setup uses this app. And there are plenty of awesome widget packs within the Play Store that are KWGT supported. Why am I telling you all this? Because the developers of KWGT were kind enough to give me 20 promo codes to KWGT Pro so I can give them away to you guys. So make sure to follow me on Twitter at HowToMen and I'll be giving them away in a few days. The icon pack that I have installed is called Minty Icons. I have the pro version but there's also a free version if you want to give it a try. This pack provides your icons with a bit of a refresh and a material look. It has 1700 icons to choose from and the developer handcrafted each one with great detail. Moving on to the wallpaper, even though I switch walls very often, the one I'm currently using comes from Mizu's stock wallpaper collection found in their Flyme 7 software update. They're all bright, colorful and abstract to make your home screen pop. I'll drop that link down below so you can download the entire wallpaper pack. Now before I show you my favorite apps, I wanted to give a massive shout out to dbrand for sponsoring this video. Even though they are a sponsor, I do use their skins on every one of my devices including the OnePlus 6 and I'm a huge fan of them. Not only do they give my phone a bit more grip, but they also provide it with a bit more personality. I'm currently using their Black Dragon skin which I think looks amazing. They have plenty of texture to choose from for various devices, so if you want to get a skin for your smartphone, I'll drop a link down below. Anyways, the apps that I use on a daily basis are your standard popular Google and social apps, including Android Messages, Chrome Beta, Google+, Gmail, Google Maps, Google Keep, Google Photos, Instagram, Relay for Reddit, Spotify, the official Twitter app, Push Bullet to use SMS on my PC and send files quickly to my computer, YouTube, and more. Since I use these on a daily basis, I decided to throw them on my home screen for easier access. Some of the other apps I use occasionally are Amazon Echo, Clash of Clans, which is my favorite game, Demo Mode Tile, which allows me to quickly enable Demo Mode for video purposes, Files Go by Google to manage and free up some space on my phone, Giganticon, which lets me create large icons on my launcher, something you see all the time in my best Android apps of the month series, Highlighter, which brings back the highlight feature within Twitter, Hue Pro to control my Philips Hue lights within my room, Nest for security purposes, Netflix, and Stop Ad, which is the best ad blocker for non-rooted devices. It's not in the Play Store, obviously, so I'll drop a link for those of you who want to grab the APK. I do have a few more apps within my app drawer, but most of them are popular apps you already know about, stock apps from OnePlus, 
and apps that I want to keep secret because they'll be in my next video for the best Android apps of the month. So make sure to subscribe with the notification bell turned on so you don't miss out on that video. Either way, that's what's on my OnePlus 6. Thank you for watching. Make sure to check out dbrand.com for some awesome skins. Follow me on Twitter at HowToMan for a chance at winning a promo code to KWGT Pro. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Kapow!